welcome to this video so in this video i'm going to be showing you guys how to basically claim your u to u a drop from the pin alliance okay now if you participated in the pin alliance uh, the telegram bot a drop then you're qualified for this a drop there's, okay there's a chance that you're qualified for this a drop only if you met up to the criteria okay i think the level is from 21 to 24 and um if you also connected your wallet before the snapshot the first snapshot now this is just season one a drop season two is still coming so uh, even if you're not qualified for this one you can still wait for that particular a drop okay so uh, as you can see this is actually a unicorn uh, ultra wallet which is the u to u uh, wallet native wallet okay and i guess you can see this is my a drop shown here okay this is basically my a drop this is actually the first time I'm, I'm opening, I'm creating this particular wallet. Okay, I have other wallets. I have the main wallet. If I click here, you can see that I have a main wallet. But this particular wallet was just specific for this airdrop. And my token was deposited into this wallet. So what I'm going to do is that I'm going to show you basically how to claim it to your OKX wallet. Because uh, it's better using OKX wallet to claim this project. And then I'll also show you how you can import your OKX wallet so that it reflects on the UTU wallet, which basically it's actually easier to uh, um, to transfer your tokens or uh, do whatever you want to do from this UTU wallet. You can see it's very simple and it looks nice. Uh, if I click on send, uh, you can just paste the wallet address, the UTU wallet address, enter the amount, and you send. And basically, your gas fee is going to be in the UTU token. And if, despite the fact that this doesn't have a value yet, um, the charge is just about uh, 0.0002 U2U. That shows that um, I'm suspecting that the charge might just be maybe 0.02 dollar, and that makes me feel that maybe this is going to be listing at a very good price. But let's just watch and see. Hopefully, my six seven hundred uh, U2U turns to a thousand dollars. But let's just wait and see. So what I need to do is basically to go to my Telegram. Now, when you open your DPN Alliance, you realize that if you go to your settings and you see my wallet, okay, you've connected several wallets. That is before the snapshot. I connected my uh, my wallet. You can see I've connected my uh, Ton wallet. I connected my uh, one of other of my wallets to MetaMask, and then OKX Ton wallet. And I think I also connected an EVM wallet, but I don't know why it's not shown here, anyways. But uh, I did basically. So what you need to do is to just, uh, the same wallet that you connected, the same wallet, what you need to do is to go to that wallet on OKX and then you copy this link. So come, first of all, come to the come to the channel. I'm also going to be leaving the link in the description of this video. Or just search for the Pin Alliance app and you see the link to this channel. Just visit this channel. I think you should go through this thing to this uh, information, the last post they made. Okay, before this claim a drop, uh, the, the the post also says that um, the position to uh, exchange is that centralized exchanges would happen by uh, 10 a.m. UTC. Uh, that is today, which is December 9th. Uh, that is equivalent to GMT plus one uh, 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 Nigerian time, 11 a.m. GMT plus one Nigerian time. So go ahead and click on this link, copy it. Okay, and then we are going to return now. But what we could basically do is to use either we use OKX or we use the native wallet, which was that wallet I showed you guys initially, the UTU wallet. But I'm going to be using the OKX wallet for the purpose of convenience. Okay, so so guys, I'm in my OKX wallet, and uh, as you can see, um, I'm make sure that you see this uh the the, the global stuff here, this icon here. Just make sure that your wallet is on all networks okay put it on all networks and then uh, when you put it on all network come to discover okay now remember we copy the link uh, to the claiming website now I do not advise you basically use your missus browser I know most people might want to copy it and take it to your missus browser to claim it from there it's going to be much difficult for you to do so the easiest and the best way to do it is just to come to your uh, OKX then come to discover paste the link that you copy here when you paste it now i have done this before so uh, it's just going to be easy for me so just click on visit external site now i advise you to use a vpn okay especially for those of you that are in nigeria 
uh, it, most of these uh, dApps do not actually work with the Nigerian network. So if you use a VPN, it makes it easy for you. Now, I did this yesterday and that is why my wallet is shown here. I connected before. So all you need to do is just to go ahead and click on connect wallet. Then uh, it takes you to back to OKX wallets for you to confirm. Go ahead and confirm the connection, sign in, and then your wallet uh, I will show here. Now, make sure that it's actually the same wallet that you link to your telegram bot make sure it's the same wallet as you can see the wallet ended with the one i linked to, to my telegram bot ended with uh, 81 uh and this one also ends with 81 so it's exactly the same wallet so scroll down okay scroll and then uh scroll now as you can see there are lots of uh, uh drops we um we have some certain quests i'm sorry that I didn't update you guys on this. The farming on Gags YouTube network. Uh, this I think this happened on Gags. I think maybe I'll look, if this is not YouTube, I'll look for information on this and then I'll update you guys. There was another uh, YouTube deep in uh, farming. Uh, okay, I don't know where this one actually happened, but I will give you guys uh, information on this if um, there is any. Um, okay, so remember, remember. This the pin alliance project is not just an ordinary um, telegram. It's not a meme coin, okay? It's actually a native token of the Solaris network, okay? It's a native token. It's a coin. So it's a real value, right? It has a value. It's a native token. As you can see, it says you to use Solaris mainnet. So this is a token or a coin for a mainnet, okay? So you can see it, is, it said here now, the very last project which says the pin alliance that is where you should scroll to uh, as you can see it says um uh you have claimed now i told you guys before that the criteria for this a drop is if you are in level 1 to 24 okay from level 1 to 24 which is the top 10,000 users on the, on the leaderboard so i'm part of those people okay and i've been able to claim it so i mine was showing six nine seven yesterday and i claimed as i showing claim so just go ahead and click on the claim and then it will just claim automatically but now when you do this and you go back to your wallet you might name you might not see it okay it's not going to reflect and why is that that is because um since you to you is a network on its own and i don't really think it's okay it's evm compatible but um it has not re really been added to OKX yet. So what you need to do is to basically add this manually. All right, is to add this manually. So there's another link I'm going to be leaving in the description of this video. So what you need to do is to just to copy that link also, then come to the discover. Okay, as you can see, the YouTube is not showing here, but it's actually in my OKX. So let's go and copy the link. So guys, I've been able to copy the link and now I'm with the link. So what I just need to do is to go ahead and paste the link that I copied and um, now note it's actually a chain.org list uh, link a uh, chain list.org sorry but it comes with a an id of the network so you don't need to search the network again if you add the 39 at the back which represents i think it represents um you to you you do not need to search for it again so visit the link and it brings you to chain list.org and as you can see, it comes with the network automatically because it has a UID of 39. But if you didn't add the UID, you can just go ahead and type U to U, and this will still show up, all right? So when that shows up, go ahead and click on Add to MetaMask. See this button here? It's meant to show blue, but I have already added to MetaMask. So you just go ahead and add, click on Add to MetaMask. When you're done, I think they might ask you to sign in, um, uh, sign in a... Uh, uh, yeah confirm and sign in it's just more like a smart contract so uh when you're done signing in you return to your wallet and then you come to the icon here see this universal icon click on it and then you remember you added a u to u network so just type u to u and you're going to see u to u solar solaris mainnet okay that's the name of the network so when you click on it you are going to see your tokens all right you're going to see your tokens yet um you might not see your tokens at first if you're doing this it doesn't come immediately 
okay so you just have to wait for some hours yesterday when i did it i checked after like two hours it didn't come but when i woke up this morning i saw that it was sent so you just wait for a couple of hours it will be sent to your wallet okay uh, it will be sent to your wallet and that is basically how to claim your u to u a drop so if you're watching my video for the very first time go ahead and hit that subscribe button like this video share this video if you have any question leave it in the comment section and for those of you that still stayed up to this moment of this video i said i was going to show you guys how you can basically add you to you network to your native or the wallet that you're using claiming this you to you to your you to you native wallet so let's proceed with that so what you basically need to do is to come to you see this icon here click on it and then come to backups okay uh, come to backups and click on wallets uh, whichever wallet you're going to see here which of the wallet whichever of the wallet that you use in claiming then you choose the wallet I uh, it was account to so I'm going to choose account to then click on private key okay click on private key when you get your private key now note note this might not work if this is not your main metamask wallet if your wallet does not have a private key okay if it i mean if it doesn't ha have a seed freeze at first it might not work so all you need to do is to go to the wallet okay whenever you create a wallet at first you're going to create a first account then later you add another wallet now that first account copy the seed phrase of that account okay i don't know if you guys understand copy the seed phrase of that account and then so i'm just going to come to play store and then i'm going to search for you to your wallet and then this is it you can see it's already installed on my phone so go ahead and install this you to you wallet coming from unicorn ultra lab um, which is the lab responsible for you to you um, or solaris network so when you down now for the very first time when you open this application you are not going to see okay you're going to be asked to enter a pin okay the first thing they will ask you to do is to enter a pin choose a pin that you're going to remember so i'm just going to go ahead and enter my own now this is not what you're going to see okay what the reason i'm saying this is because i imported two wallets already number one is my main wallet number two is the utu wallet now i advise you to import the main wallet uh if, okay go and get the seed phrase of your main wallet okay on metamask or just go ahead and create a new wallet do you get that go ahead and create a new wallet and then you're going to get the seed phrase then when you're done come here click on here this place then click on new wallet okay when you click on new wallet it will prompt you to enter either use a seed phrase or a private key now remember that now remember that if i click private key it's going to review my private key but i'm not going to do that because i don't want you guys to know my private key okay so just get that private key that you will find when you get it then yeah when you get the private key you come back to your unicorn ultra uh, wallet and then you go ahead and click on new wallet and then you click on import and then you choose you to you network and then you paste your uh recovery freeze now if you do not have a recovery freeze you can decide to use a private key so i prefer you use a private key because you can only copy a private key from uh, uh okx one so when you enter your enter your private key you click on next this button becomes active and then when you click on next it shows your wallet now what you notice is that if that your token is deposited you're going to see this token here okay that's to show you that it's successful so you're going to see this number of tokens the exact number of tokens you have in your case wallet will show here it's as simple as that now i would advise you to use this wallet because it's actually very very easy to use okay i always prefer using native wallets just like i'm using for tron and uh, tron link for tron and other wallets like that so i prefer you import this wallet and you know use this so when you ever want to send it to an exchange maybe being x or whichever exchange you can just go ahead and click on send and then you paste the wallet address enter the amount and you've been able to forward it that's all for this video guys make sure you hit that subscribe button again like this video share this video if you have any question leave it in the comment section see you some other time guys bye